I was telling Maxwell that I literally had to get stripped down at TSA pre-check. Never happened before. Like, and what I mean, like, I'm not exaggerating. Like, oh, they made me take off my belt. Like, no, I had to take off my shoes, my belt, my coat, my jacket, and then my pants. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> but usually, with like having TSA pre-check, you kind of like get to skip all that. But because I have like this electrolyte powder mix, they made me completely stripped down. And I was like. I promise I don't have like more powder keistered up my ass or something. That's <laughs> what it is, because we got here so early for our flight. It's kind of nice. I've just been like editing stuff on my phone. Oh yeah, we're going to Milan. I didn't even say that. It'll be fun. It'll be a good time. Can't wait to bring you guys along. We'll see some familiar faces. We'll go to cool places. Faces, places. I thought I said the same word, but it just rhymed. Fashion week, baby. We're back, 2024. Clink. Just landed in Frankfurt, Germany on a layover, going to Milan. Got like an hour of sleep on that 11 hour flight. It was boiling hot. But we land in Milan at what, 1 p.m.? And then we have a full day, pretty much. A couple fittings to power through. Let's get some coffee. So studious. You have the guy who's sleeping in the airport too. Probably. This fucking statue. Come over here. See you tomorrow. Yo, there's statues. What? All right, you guys know the deal. As I wait for my luggage, we are seven of nine here. Mm, my fault. This place is stunning. Okay, look. Door. Right. We open up. Bam. Left. Bam. Big closet. Full body mirror. Big bathroom. Lovely shower. Towels in the shower. Unheard of. Dolce and Gabbana robe. Shout out y'all. We're gonna mosey on over and we're gonna go to the mini bar where I have already torn into the cashews and a Red Bull. MCM sent me a little gift. Shout out MCM. Bam. And then look, cool little back to back TVs. <laughs> Cause then this is the bed. The bed's lovely. Big bed. Dolce slippers. Haven't even checked the view yet. Wow, wait, not bad. People watching. That's the lobby right down there so I can see when people arrive and stuff. Milano, ciao. Going to our second fitting, we're running on damn near 30 something hours. I have no sleep. 
so I am the Lulu right now. But going to the JW Anderson fitting, we have a reservation for a dinner tonight, just Maxwell and I. And if we have any friends in Milan that want to pull up, if you're watching this now, come, come eat with us. That's what we're doing, stay tuned. So typically when I travel, or honestly I've been doing it just like in general now, because especially in the winter too, my skin dries out like a lot, unfortunately, like I can't really do anything about that. But what I can do is I can double cleanse. <laughs> and I only do this at night. I kind of just started to do it because I was like, my skin's still burning. Hello, I wasn't done talking to you guys yet. Hold on. I can't pick you up just yet because you guys decided to just fall, which is annoying. And I have cleanser all over my face and hands. That was crazy of you guys. Anyways, so I like to double cleanse and then right after I cleanse, I'll do this like hydrating mist. Three should be fine. I'll do a little of this bamboo firming fluid. I can't stress this enough. It's like, it's what works for you. You know, some people may be like, no, don't do that. Like, it's not good for your skin. <laughs> well then why does my skin feel and look amazing? when I do that, you know? But to be fair, like, you guys have helped me like with my awareness of some things. Like sometimes I am doing something that's like bad for my skin. And that was just a moisturizer. Something to have on the face so it doesn't dry out in the middle of the night. But recap on the day. I can't, like, I can't even think straight right now. I'm so tired, so. I hope you guys enjoyed that little unwind nightcap with Noah. You guys can get more of this trip, but let me like first get at least some sleep and then I'll be more sane for the days to come. So for more filming and more energy, cause your boy is, I'm about to just knock right now. And it is 9.47 PM. We're right on track for a good night's sleep. So I love you guys, good night. I'll see you in like eight or nine hours, maybe 10 if I'm feeling tired, which I am. So I love you guys. For me, it'll be like eight to 10 hours. For you guys, it'll be like, watch this one second, ready? Oh, no. 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 no, you gotta cover the 
Welcome, Welcome back to the Oh my god, the show was so amazing. Hello. I'm with my boys. Welcome, Dolce. Hello. <laughs> Back at the hotel. I don't know where I put you guys. All right, so just got back from the Dolce & Gabbana show and it was absolutely incredible. I'm not even saying that because I'm here with Dolce or that I just went to the show. Like it was genuinely probably my favorite collection in my three years of fashion, I guess. I go to a good amount of shows and that was mwah, chef's kiss. Like it was genuinely incredible, elegant, chic, like just like dark. I, it was just, it was amazing. It was class. That was amazing. And then I have the Dolce & Gabbana Dinner tonight, a little intimate dinner, and then before that, me, Carter, and Maxwell are gonna go grab some grab some lunch, and I think you guys are gonna come with, if that's all right with you guys, of course. I can see some of you guys from down, from down here. I was just stopped down before the hotel. It was amazing saying hi to all you guys down there, but I can see you guys, I can snipe you. Watch. Look at you, you little rascals. JW Anderson show recap. It was good, cool atmosphere, cool environment, cool people. Went back to the hotel, quick change, because we're going to the AC Milan versus Roma game, which I'm really excited about. But just got word, I can't bring you guys, unfortunately. So I'll try to get footage on my phone, but I was really looking forward to getting some sick clips on the camera. But I can't take you guys, but I love you, and I gotta go, love fashion. And love soccer even more. So, sorry fashion, but soccer has my heart and will always will. And I gotta go, but I love you guys. I'm gonna try to get clips on my on my phone. Don't move. was our time in Milan. Absolutely amazing. It was good, love Milan. But now we're going to Paris, I'm really excited for that. And then we'll have, Paris is gonna be probably a better vlog because I have a lot more like free time. 
and so we'll be able to do more things together. I didn't have a lot of free time this trip. Hopefully we can do some fun things in Paris, but I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to us, put us post notifications, make sure you comment and like, give it a big thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in next vlog in Paris. That was Milan, ciao. I started trying to rewatch it at one point, but I'm so zoomed in, I didn't get the slap. Let's run that back. Okay. Okay, I'm wow. right out. Wow. Another. <laughs> I'm gonna transition into the next clip like this. <laughs> Smoke out. <laughs>